Welcome to this tutorial. Um, in this tutorial, I'd like to show you how to install custom Aerofly models on OS X. Um, I assume that you already downloaded the model you uh, want to install, um, uh, like this one here. And after that, uh, just open another uh, Finder window. And now we uh, have to navigate to a hidden folder. And therefore, we press Command Shift G. And then uh, I just copy paste the folder. It's quite lengthy. Um, uh, please see the comment for the full uh, path. So you can just copy paste it from there. And now we open the folder. And here you see the aircraft and aircraft mod folder. So now we uh, unzip uh, the, the model uh, file by just double clicking it. And if we open the folder, we see an aircraft and aircraft mod folder. And we copy the content of each folder to the one in the right window. OK, that's it. So now open um, Aerofly. And this is our new model, which you can load by going to Load Model. And then you should see a new category, Custom Models. And here we go. The charter has been installed. OK, so um, just one additional note. Um, if you'd like to access the folder easier, then you can just add it uh, to the sidebar here or you can create an alias uh, to uh, any other location you like, for example, the desktop. So you drag the folder and hold Command Option pressed, and then you see the, the uh, cursor symbol changes, and then you can just drop the folder. And then you have easy access to the Aerofly RC uh, folder. Um, the problem here is it's a hidden folder, unlike on Windows, so it's not so easy to actually uh, um, find out the path. Um, yeah, that's it. If uh, an Aerofly developer uh, listens to this, please add a menu entry that does all these steps automatically. Um, yeah, so I hope it works for you, and uh, see you next time.